Jim 1 by Mekazawa. Just three maps. Let's take a look at map three. Now it turns out they're not really supposed to be played from a pistol start. Um, really? You got me for 15 from there with all these imps in your way? I think that's very necessary to be stated that something's not meant for continuous. Otherwise, um, it's just, you know, I, I, a lot of players are going to pistol start maps unless specifically told otherwise. I like this. This is just, this is a, this is gray whatever, but the lighting is so dark that it looks like a different texture. Come on, barrels. Cooperate with me. That didn't work. Okay then. We're just gonna... Oh, we got the slopes out now. Oh, there's multiple waves. Yeah, alright. This is gonna be bad. Next is the chain gunner wave. That's gonna be very good. Oh no, imps. Okay. We can deal with imps. Hopefully we're done now. Here's the thing about continuous though. None of the previous two maps even had a rocket launcher. In fact, I didn't even I never even got a super shotgun anyway, so it's like what did I really lose? Not sure if I lost anything, really. So Mekazawa does like to do these big kind of set pieces with lots of enemies coming in in different waves. What are we dealing with? 421, 56, and 2 this time. Gotta say, Mekazawa creates some pretty good looking maps, especially with just vanilla textures. That might be glidable right there. Come on. I've said this before in different maps, but I always think it's better to put switches in SW1 state. Especially in, an, in a map that's non-linear at all, because... I might see this and think, oh, I already hit that switch. You know, if I come back to it later, forget about it for a while, come back to it later. But that's not true. Okay, that's the blue switch. This is a nice little cave section. I like the different textures. Um, <clears throat> I would probably vary the lighting a little bit more, like make this deepest section nice and dark and brighten on your way out kind of thing. I'm going to save that for later, I think. There's blue key. Dead. I'm going to get that Berserk, I think. I hate... I really don't like leaving them behind. But I really don't like getting them when I don't need the health either. <laughs> so often I find myself kind of intentionally playing really badly, or at least recklessly, so that I have an excuse to go get the Berserk. Oh, hello, hello. Oops, wrong button. 
I guess we'll punch a few of them. Hey. All right. So we go this way. All right, let's save here. Okay, this is where we came out, or this is—that's where we were before, right? So for me, the previous map was ruined by the weaponry. It was just shotgun, chain gun. No super shotgun, no rocket launcher, nothing at all. Um, so this map, you do get a super shotgun. That makes a big difference. I'm starting to think I'd like to have a rocket launcher too. Some of this fighting is getting a little bit tedious, a little bit borderline grindy, I guess. Alright, so I got the blue key. I guess we just backtrack here. We're at probably, oh, we're at 194 already. Kill count's gone up a little bit with the pain elementals. Yeah. There's a lot more kills. <laughs> But yeah, I mean, this is what the previous map was. A lot of Manx and Revenants, um, even some Hell Knights, Pain Elementals, but not even a Super Shotgun. I think it's, I think you can appreciate the desire for a rocket launcher, but uh, at least I have a Super Shotgun, so I'm not going to complain just yet. I might later but not just yet. And I got a backpack now so I can get all these shells. All right, so we got plenty of ammo. I wonder if this is some sort of, oh, you can't even, huh. It's a weird impassable wall right there. Oh, I did not want that. That's a waste. <laughs> All right, so we'll we'll do the blue switch here, and oh boy, we have three. Hmm. So we had a cave section here. We're gonna do another cave section here. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, there's plenty of shells. It seems like so I know need to punch out these demons. Ow. Oh crap. That went a lot better than it could have. So I think I'm gonna do killing with two suits, and then I'll try to progress with the last one. That is if I don't die. 
Did I leave any health behind? No. That was an unnecessary hit, too. Really unnecessary hit. But yeah, I mean, right now it's like... If I hadn't played map 2 already, I would be saying... Wait a minute, where did I miss the rocket launcher? Like, that's absolutely what I'd be saying. And then I'd realize, oh wait, I don't have any rockets. I don't have any ammo either. So I didn't actually miss the rocket launcher. So the map is just boring. That's all. I understand the desire to make a map hard, but sometimes withholding a weapon isn't the way to do that. Sometimes all that does is make it boring. And that's what's happening. That's what's happening here. Um. But yeah, imagine this kind of style of combat. Oh crap, we gotta go. With no super shotgun either. Alright. Just wanna get that health. And then we'll go jump into the whatever over here. Whoa. Oh, okay. That's what we're doing there. That makes a lot of sense. Okay. Oh, I thought this was the way I needed to go. Not at all. <laughs> this is just death. Alright. We'll try to find something else. Um, oh crap. Well, where else can I go? What did I miss here? Okay. Well, that opens up. <laughs> that might open up, too. Such a good time for a rocket launcher. It'd be so much fun little humans everywhere. Hmm, did not account for him. So he got me good. But there's a little more health here. I like that use of this flat as a texture. Gotta use some bullets. Yeah, pretty good lighting in here. <clears throat> noticeable lighting um, but yeah I mean you're given abundant bullets and shells which is great but that probably should be upper unpegged right there um, but yeah this is just oh man same old same old so many mid tiers so few weapons somebody got me good oh there's a chain gun over there Okay, got me good again. 15, 15. I'm just gonna hit the switch.
Don't know what the switch did. Maybe this is secret. Yeah, probably want to split that line and clean that up a little bit. Oh gosh, that's the end of me. I'm not actually sure what that switch does. Maybe, maybe it does open up that area that I was going into. Yeah, let's go that way. Armor's good. No, get the armor. Health is good, too. Quite the little maze here. Well played that time. Distract me with the chain gunners. Spring the Revenant, not bad. But yeah, where is my rocket launcher? Oh gosh. Okay, I'm just gonna resurrect now. Don't feel like playing this again. Here, we'll take some unnecessary damage. There we go. But yeah. <clears throat> so the previous map I said we need a super shotgun or a rocket launcher. This map I'm saying we need a rocket launcher or a plasma gun. It's just get, this is too boring. I don't want to kill f almost 500 enemies without a rocket launcher. I mean, you don't have to give me a hundred rockets. Give me a handful. Give me 30 rockets. Just give me some freaking rockets. This is boring. Looks like I've explored everything here. I think I gotta go in another way to get the armor. Oh, okay, so, yeah. That's it. Alright, so I did hit a switch in there, so I accomplished something.
Okay. I don't need any of that. There's an extra battle over there. Oh wow, thought he was too far. I thought I was hitting him. There we go. Oh, wow. <sighs> All right. Definitely need that. Alright, so red. Just the soul sphere. Yeah, okay. Cool. So that's why those suits are on that other side, because you gotta go back the way you came, which is what I'm about to do here, once I get over here, nope, over here, oh gosh. See this is just a boring trap because there's nothing behind me, I mean there's a mech somewhere but I can just back up and shoot these guys forever. Cacnea. Yeah, I forgot about the cacnea's. I don't feel like dealing with them either. Alright, blue. Wait, red. So much it's get. It's unbelievable. So much. Wait, box of rockets? I can get a rocket. Oh my goodness, there's a rocket launcher. Wow. Un unbelievable. Alright, so, we'll grab that. Just like that, I've got 
90 rockets and 200 health and we're about to have 200 armor this room looks nice make that 95 rockets There's only seven, there's only 22 enemies left. They can't be right in this. Oh crap. Yeah, this is gonna be one of those Jeezy, Jeezy Doom false enemy counter situations. Does that mean I can leave now? Through there? <clears throat> well, that was long, long overdue. <laughs> But yeah, kind of a fun little hectic section there. Oh, that's the end. Okay. Yeah, well... Again, I think a, a really nice setup, a good layout. The combat is just too boring when the enemies are so many meaty enemies, beefy enemies. Revenants and Hell Knights and Pain Elementals and Cacodemons everywhere, and you don't get a rocket launcher. I mean, in this case, it was okay for the first, I don't know, for the first quarter or so. We'll say the first third. It was okay for the first third, but then you just got tired of super shotgunning all these big monsters. You really wanted a rocket launcher. And then for the second third, it was boring. And then finally for the last third, you did get a rocket launcher, so... You know, that, that middle third especially was just so dull, and yet the map was good. You know, the map itself, all it needed was a slightly earlier rocket launcher with, you know, that room had a hundred plus rockets in it. <clears throat> I'm not saying give me that early, I'm just saying give me 20 to 30 rockets early. And then that room, you know, you build up your store for that last fight, you don't need to give them all to me right away. But some of them, um, the camping, it, it was still kind of a factor. I didn't think it was so bad in this map. Um, you know, just a lot of cluster killing, really. You know, tons of humans in one area. You chain gun them all, you super shotgun them all. And that's fairly gratifying. Really, it was just the, the meaty stuff that got boring in a hurry. Just super shotgunning them over and over and over again. <clears throat> So yeah, I don't know what else Mechazawa has done or is planning on doing, but uh, I think a really good mind for level design in general and, and the space of the maps. Um, I would suggest thinking about um, just a little bit less camping nature of some of the maps or some of the parts of the maps. And just let Doomguy have a little more fun. Just just give him more weaponry. Just give him, give up. I mean, this is a wad of 
This one, this one had 400 enemies, the map 2 had, I don't know, two, 300. So a lot of maybe 700 enemies, not a plasma gun in sight, and one rocket launcher. Um, just, just let Doomguy have a little more fun. You know, you can make maps harder in different ways, but that's not one that players generally prefer. Alright, that's map 3 by, or map 3 of Gene 1 by Mechazawa.